Ryan Donaghy. Birthday Live. Hiding his face even on a live. Warning. Pass the sick bucket. What follows is a selection of Ryan's vulnerable followers including Julia. So, as long as the big lads and the, and the big names are all up for it, then let's make it work. Oh, I've got to wait for it. Who are you going to stop with? We're going to kick it off with Lawrence. Oh, that'll be that be comedy gold. Yeah, next week we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna go and pick him up. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Does that mean oh, that means you're near me next week? Is that where he's from? Yeah, wherever he is, we're gonna. Oh, big... oh my god, yes, that's gonna be fucking comedy gold. <laughs> also, Buzz, he ask him. To go yeah. to the local area called Sutton. Okay. We've got to do a it's bit of research. Yeah. Every, every week we'll do a research on the area we're picking the person up from. and then we'll Yeah, they're going to be comedy gold. <laughs> oh, <Okay>. shit, no. <laughs> I'm not going to be able to see you. I'm in Turkey. What? You'll see it two hours after us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But I said, I'm gonna, I said I might go patrolling in Turkey. Ah, uh, yeah, man, you should. Uh, I don't even know yet. No, trust me, like... <laughs> I admit, yeah, I don't care what the mods say, mods. All I want is one chance in the fucking Discord. I ain't gonna mess around. So uh, I'll give that on to you. Like, I'm changing that. But I mean, so, I, Jeff, you've always been alright with me, mate. Honestly, you, you, know, you, you know what it is, and I'll admit, and I'll, I'll Go on, admit this year, what happened Thanks, back man. then. I'll happily say this now. Back then, people were trolling bars a lot of times, yeah. And also, another thing to have it on is that I had Buzz in my name. You get what I mean? Yeah. Was you, tro was you trolling yeah, me, Jeff? I, I, I had it. I wasn't on board. Uh, Jeff, was you trolling me, I mean? little shit? Yeah? Who the fuck? Buzz, I would never have told you, mate. <laughs> it's all right. I don't care, anyway. No, exactly. But, yeah. I mean, fair enough. I would look. If I had Buzz in my name, people would target me. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's not as bad now, is it? Thing. And that's the thing. I've learned that. And that's what I said. I'm sorry to all the mods for causing that shit, and it ain't going to happen again. Big up yourself, mate. Nice one, man. Big up, Jeff. Respect, Jeff. That's, Respect, that's like, I've said it. it. Like, I know a lot of the mods thought, when I got blocked, and I thought, fuck it, I'm going to be blocked. We'll leave it up to the mods. I'm that. sure the mods will, will take that into consideration, Jeff. Do your peel. I'm sure you've just done it, and big up yourself for that, mate, because it takes a lot of balls nah. to come in here, 300 people in. Fair play to you. Yeah, yeah. but like I say, but yeah, you're the guy, isn't it? You're the guy that keep has made me think about shit. My life, look at that four or five months ago. My life was shit, and seeing this, you've made me look at life in a better view of everything. Big up, man. Hey, let, let's work... go, bro. Listen, if that's true, that's respect. I mean, I don't. No, think... but I'll tell you something here. I was working. <laughs> what was it? I was working night shift here, only having three to Thank four you, hours everybody. sleep. Yeah. I was only having three hours sleep here mm -hmm. and going to work. Like, coming home, going straight to work. Coming home, going to work. And then, obviously, I took a month off, started watching the bus text and all that, and it just oh, made man. me change. I've changed a lot. Like, people don't think about it, yeah? I'll admit to you. I'll admit this now. I'm dyslexic, autistic. I've got speech problems and all that, yeah? Mm -hmm. People, I'll admit, I've got no friends in the world. I had not it's hard for me to make real life friends because of my special needs. We're friends, man. Like, You're honestly, right, yeah. when I mean friends, you know, like, I'll speak, bit, to anyone. Yeah. I'll speak to anyone in public. Do you get what I mean? Yeah, man. Oh, I'll be go up and go, oh, what, mate? How are you? You get what I mean? Yeah. Good that's who I am. Come on now. Keep up, keep up the good work, boss. Cheers, Katie. Thank you, darling. Thank you for joining oh, us. Lovely. See you later, guys. Good night. Good night. Bye, Bye, Cheers. Bye. Thank you. Oh, Chippy, I know you all are, but I'm just saying how it is. Like, I'll admit to yeah, you. Yeah, I know what that. you're saying. Listen, the thing like, is, I'll sometimes... Admit, yeah. I'll admit, yeah, when I was in school, yeah? Yeah. I'll admit, when I was in secondary school, people... For, I went to a mainstream secondary school first, and I got bullied every day. I was bullied... I was punched up, I was called retarded, spasticated, everything, yeah. Jesus, mate. And then I got and then I got a transfer to a special needs um school, SEN school. Yeah. And I tried to and I was there till the end of the year I made it there till about this time 2013, 2014. Mm -hmm. 
And then I went to colleges and then all the bullying happened again. So then I left all that behind me and I started working and just become trying to become a better person in myself. Well, mate, let, 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 me, let, me, let me say this here, and I'm sure everyone can agree on this. Like, the fact that you've come into a group chat like this and, the, you know, there's a few hundred people in here and you're speaking openly about it, mate. You should be proud of yourself for that, bro. Honestly, I man. Know, and, that, and I mean uh, that. that like, that's big. Like, that, that's a big step, man. And, I, I, you know, these anyone bullying you at all, mate, they want to pack it up because the bus fam will come heavy out. And, you know, no, I don't down get bullied on... anymore. Like, I stand my ground now and all that. Go ahead. But like I say, it is sad. It is sad. But you're, I'll admit, Good night, John. It. it's only because of where I live in London. It's a rough area. Yeah. And I've had to grow up being targeted. I've been... People... I'll admit, people used to chase me to my front door. I got kicked. I almost got... I almost... I, have a bit, I got kicked by a gay at my own front door. And then I got physically got kicked in the back of my front door. About four years ago. Oh, mate, sorry to hear this, man. No, I don't care, mate, because at the end of the day, like what I say, they know, they know that people know now because I've got a big dog and all that. Like, I can walk around my area and people will be like, oh, hello, Jeff, how are you? You get what I mean? Like, I'm known around my area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, people know me in my area, but they know me for, let's see this. Oh, I admit, I don't know if you heard, have you heard of the Princess Trust? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, oh, I admit, I've done, I've done that. 2017, I've done the June 2017, yeah. And we did it, we did not complete the whole program, so we, mm-hmm. we stopped the whole program mm-hmm. and we spent, we went, we fundraised 1500 pounds. We went to JD Sports, Sports Direct, spent 1500 pounds on everything and gave it to Grenfell. Well done, man. Well done, Jeff. Like, well done, Jeff. Yo, Princess big up to a million Sammy right now, guys. Show some love for these two. Look I've at this. Lo- yeah, I've done that. I've done the Duke of Edinburgh. Thank you, girls. I've worked with the elderly. I've worked with a lot of people. Or even the homeless. Like, Respect, people don't believe me. Yeah, people, no, I'll admit to you. People you need a homeless person on the door. I'll admit to you. I'll admit to you. I've got... If anyone knows the area, two teams, South West kicked. London, by a gay... Yeah, no, no, I'll have to share this story. There's and then I've got the mother and son that lived on the front door. Outside, about four years ago. Library. And the mother sadly passed away last year with coronavirus. There was a Somalian family. But... And this is true now what I'm going to say. Yeah. Wandsworth Council have offered them a state of the art fundraise brand new house, yeah? Uh huh. They decline it. Wow. Because they would rather live on, they would rather live independ- independently on the street, how they've been living at that bench for the past 10 years. And, and I mean it, the guy goes in McDonald's every morning. Or used to, and I'd wash and I'll always buy him a coffee. Yeah. Oh, like hi, bye. Where I live, hello, I Danny. Oh, hello. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, you are right? Yeah, I'm fantastic, sweet. How are you? I'm fine. I just really wanted to say that you, I know I say it quite a bit, but you are literally amazing. Come on. No, I never I'm ever trying. let Daddy. anybody. Daddy tell you any different yeah because i've got mental health and literally watching your lives and everything like that honest to god you are literally <laughs> the greatest honest to god mm. he is. that's so nice he is like, it me thank you honestly you guys so you know what lives. it's crazy because like the love is incredible and you honestly i don't know like I don't know. I don't know, man. It's crazy. I can never get you. It's not something you can go, oh, yeah, I'm fucking so used to this. But honestly, thank you so much, Stan. I know, honestly, I know yeah. people come on here and they're like, you don't really get a chance to speak to you like properly, but I just really wanted to say, you know, you are amazing, amazing person, and you yes. just need to keep doing what you're doing. I don't know you personally, but from what I've seen, literally, just keep rocking and doing it because you're helping a lot of people and I will...